Megan, it's me. How good was Fiona? I loved all those ideas and I'll definitely be doing some of those great ideas, particularly the moon sand one, um, with my boys at home in isolation. Um, and you could even use those molds that she was using for some bath bombs. So how clever she was. So I'm going to take you now into my laundry. <laughs> so that you just got of the swimming pool. can see Cass is there and Jerry's flooding some swies the old natural way which is also a very good money saving tip um, to our laundry so I love my new laundry look at these tiles aren't they amazing I do like them um, so why I have brought you in here is for some money saving tips which I think everybody needs at the moment um, and also making sure that you're cleaning with safe um, really healthy materials in your for your kids for your kids lungs for your lungs for everybody and particularly at this time so if you don't know the story of thieves then I suggest that you go and ask the person who introduced you or ask the person who introduced you to tell you why we should be using thieves at the moment. Um, it was, or I can give you a little snippet. It was back way, 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 way ago in the olden days. So everything from Young Living is with a purpose um, and has a story behind it. So that is why I use thieves. So anyway, hi, Christine. Hope you had a good day at work. So, the first thing that I'm going to share with you is which one I've got so many of my favorite these products here, and I'm going to show you oh no, how to dilute them and get more for your money. Hi. So, let's start with drum roll. Since we're in the laundry, let's start with our laundry soap. So. This baby, I absolutely love. So before, oh, it's a bit glary, isn't it? So before Young Living brought out their laundry soap, I used to make my own. And so I literally was like a little white witch in the sink and I had a big pot and I would great sunlight soap and I would add in some washing soda and I would stir it and make it set and then use it that way, which was beautiful and it smelled amazing and it did clean everything. So I still do like that recipe, but this is so much easier, particularly when you have three crazy children and um, time is poor. So this baby is my godsend. So it says here that it is for 64 loads. And it says that it's six times ultra concentrated. So there's no water in this baby. Or there might be a little bit of water. There is some water in it. But because it is so thick and gluggy, you can actually make it into not one bottle, but you can actually make it into how many bottles do I have here? I have quite a lot because I like to reuse these because they're really good to reuse. And then I don't have to worry about it. So I keep my empty bottles and so what I do is in here I dilute this into three so I divide this and all of mine is really just a guess because that's the way I roll I put about that much can you see about that much whereabouts is it I usually go off like the letter T so half of the letter T I put um, of the Thieves Laundry Soap in and then I put just because I am a house of boys. I put two capfuls into this. So this is the Thieves Household Cleaner. So this is a go-to for everything. So in a capful of this, it is 10 mils. So it's about 20 mils. And then if I want to do a little bit of extra brightening and different things like that, I add some lemon. Um, another flavor because you don't 
Angela, I'm talking about you. You can mix it up and add different smells in. So you can put lemon, you can put citrus fresh, you can put lavender, any oils that you like. I do like the lemon to sort of give it that extra little bright. If you do love the thieves and want an extra child, maybe it's your thing. So then I just fill it up with water into my wash and off I go. So how amazing is that? So I because you can make more for your budget. So that is what I love to do and I do love it dearly. It is one of my go-tos. Hi, Michelle. Good to see you. I hope that you loved your Thieves laundry soap sample. So you can even post whether you liked it or not. So, because I gave you the diluted version. So, that is the Thieves laundry soap that you can dilute. So, these are really good to keep. So, don't throw them out because you can reuse them and then you don't have to worry about it. Okay. Then, another hot tip that I've got to saving you money is... The Thieves Cleansing Soap. Guess what I use it for? In the laundry. Does anyone want to have a guess? Waiting, waiting, waiting. I know. Kimmy, it's so amazing, isn't it? Well, I use it like my sunlight soap. So, I don't know about you, but my work uniform, whether it's just being a preschool teacher, I don't know, but it gets really, really dirty, really, really easy. Yes, the stain remover, Kimmy. So, this baby, you can see how much I've used it already. I think I've had it oh, so long. It has lasted so long. So anyway, I just pop in my bucket in the sink a little bit of this. If it's extra um, dirty, I'm so pleased you loved it, Michelle. Then I do add a little bit of this in, like a capful. And maybe some lemon oil too. And then I scrub it up dub the stains off with this. It is amazing. And it lasts forever. And it smells good. And it's absolutely incredible. So I don't use the thief soap to clean my body. I use it to clean my clothes, like the old fashioned days. Um, so it is a miracle worker. And I honestly have had this for ages. So that is a hot tip for that one. Now, um, what shall I do next? I'm going to go with, since at the moment we need to be washing our hands. So, I make my own hand wash to save more money. So, instead of getting the thieves pump, but you can get the thieves pump and just use that. Um, and also use that as a container if you like, but I got these little babies online. Anyway, I buy, hi Tracy, the, hi Lorraine, I buy the Thieves Refill. So, what I actually do is in this bottle, I put about a tablespoon, but I'm not good at measuring. So, honestly, it's about where my finger is, like down here, down near the H. And then I fill it up with water. That is it. So you have this amazing foaming hand wash that will last you. I'm not joking. This big bottle, this big refill bottle has lasted over a year. And I give out hand wash all the time. So this is a really good money saving thing to do. So yes, so it is amazing. And that is how, particularly at the moment, you can make your hand wash go even further. So as well with this hand wash, it actually um, makes your hands feel so nice and soft and beautiful. I forgot to take it to work this week and I did a lot of hand washing and my hands after one day of just using the soap at preschool was all dry, all crusted, all red and sore and horrible. So I'll be taking this baby into work um, to make sure that my hands stay nice and soft, so moisturizing. And then, so that is a good money saving tip because it will last you honestly forever. 
let me see what we have here. We have our trusted. Oh, that's a good idea, Lindell. Adding an extra cup, couple of drops of thieves, particularly at this time. That would be amazing. And if you don't like the smell of thieves, Miss Angela, you can add lemon. You can add citrus fresh. You can add lavender. You can add whatever. You can add joy to bring you some love in your heart. You can add whatever oils you like to make it smell a different smell. But that thieves is the best thing to be using at the moment. Okie dokie. This is our trusted thieves cleaner. And you know that I'm not a numbers person, but my hubby, just very quickly, which was really nice of him, worked out how much this baby costs. Does anyone want to have a guess at how much it costs? Is it $6? Like what you would pay at a grocery store. Is anyone going to guess? Whoop, whoop. Poor connection. There we go. It, this baby. Woo! Awesome, Lindo. This baby is so cheap. Oh, good guessing. A dollar, Olivia. A dollar, Mackenzie. Two dollars, Michelle. I think three dollars, Lisa. I'm actually think we've got a winner. Michelle, I think you're pretty much spot on. In this particular bottle, because it is 600 mils, it is, Dan worked it out to be like a dollar 85. So let's say two dollars because... In mine, I do add a sneaky little tip, which is what I will show you why I do that in a minute. So, we have this baby, which is our Thieves household cleaner. So, this at a wholesale price costs $39.90. So, in this 600ml bottle, we use two capfuls. So, that is like super cheap. So, it's 20 mils. So one cap full is 20 mils. So in it goes into the jar. And then I do add half a cup of white vinegar. The reason why I add the white vinegar is, well, you all know how good vinegar is to clean, but it gives your mirrors and your stainless steel and your windows that extra little oomph, which is amazing. So I do love it. And I'm going to show you my dirty bathroom. And then my clean bathroom, because I'm going to show you how this baby works. Um, so, yeah, so two cup in my 600ml bottle. So if you've got a smaller bottle, it would be smaller. Two capfuls, half a cup of white vinegar, and then fill the rest with water. So it is a bit amazing. Shall we go? I'll go. I'll show you my dirty bathroom and show you the difference. Okay, here we go. I don't know who you're going to see, who you're going to meet on the way through. Let's go. Okay. I love that one. Ooh, someone's going for a walk in a pram. Oh, no. I told you, you never know what you're going to see. Okay. So, as you can see, I'm just about to close. There's yuck in the sink. There's toothpaste down here. There's two, but it is not looking that good for you. So, hush and spray the sink and spray. I'm just gonna spray, spray, spray. And then in the vanity, I like using some paper towel. So I'm just gonna grab some paper towel and rub the window. Do the thieves cleaner, do the thieves cleaner, around and around. Let's get some inspiration from the wiggles. And the reason why I add the vinegar is because then there is no streak marks. Window cleaner and then a basin cleaner and then a toilet cleaner, and then a this, and a that. You can all just use the same cleaner and save money at the checkout by using this baby. And, 
and so easy to make. So then I clean this part, the sink, and then the basin, not the basin, the vanity. So I can clean the vanity. Whoops. And what you wanted to do on my live is watch me clean my sink, didn't you? So I just wanted to share with you how amazing this stuff really is because you do not need another cleaning product. You just need this baby. And at only $39.90 and it will honestly last you six months, this is just ridiculous. You can use it on your barbecue. You can use it to wash the car. You can use it for the toilet. You can use it for absolutely. There is not one thing that this baby cannot clean. So, I just have a little bit of stuck toothpaste. So you just give that a little bit of a spray and get that off. So easy. Now, there's no more gunk. There's no nothing. It is incredible. Ta-da! Ta-da! What do you think? And thank you for helping me get motivated to clean. I just quickly washed my hand because I'm going to take you back. Oh, sorry. That's my beautiful tiles. I'll flip you back over. Hello. So, yes, it is absolutely incredible. So I'm going to take you back to my laundry and I've got time. I don't know if I've still got time. I'm sure Kimmy will let me know if I'm going over. So this baby is incredible. So I use it for so much. You can dilute this baby and you don't need to use it like this. So containers that you previously haven't divided into three and then you can use it in your dish soap. If you like bubbles, I found a really good hack. I can't remember who shared it with me, but I know that my other friend, Rebecca, um, loves bubbles. And she wasn't happy with this baby because it didn't have bubbles. Well, if you add some of the body, the bubbles for you, and then you're keeping safe and you're keeping clean and you've got bubbles. So, um, that is a really good spoon into your mixture to make the bubbles. Um, so that's really clever. But this baby, you can actually put in your dishwasher. I know it says never put dish soap in your dishwasher, but because this one doesn't have bubbles, maybe don't do it if you put the bubbles in, but you can just squirt a little bit of this into your dishwasher and it will help to wash your dishes. And then you don't even have to buy dish soap. While I'm talking about dishwasher, just add a cap full of these cleaner in and then that's your dish is incredible um i don't know so i do love this baby um mouthwash you can dilute it so you can dilute it into three or you can even make a little spray with your mouthwash so um just ask vicky about that because she is really good at making up those little sprays she's got that recipe and one more thing to save you money at the checkout thieves toothpaste not only can you use it to brush your teeth you can use it for deodorant um so yeah so just pop a little bit on your finger and then rub it on like what you do with the other brands where that you can't roll it on and you have your own deodorant. So when you're traveling and you need to save room in packing, you can use your toothpaste as a toothpaste. A few little bits to save you money at the checkout um, in using this valuable product with Thieves. So I love it. And if you want to do some different recipes that I've got as well, um, and I look forward to hearing to you. Make sure to comment and keep watching because we've got more beautiful speakers for the rest of the afternoon and into the night time. And if you can't watch, you can come back. So even if you can't watch it live at the moment, just say that you're joining and you can come back and watch everybody and their talks. Okay. Nice to see you. Bye.